gun drawn and someone had pulled the fire alarm and that's when I heard police, the MPs, everybody was just coming down the car with sirens. And what did the shot sound like? It was like pow, pow, pow. And then in a few seconds it stopped and then it pow, 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 pow. So we just ran. Did you hear ran. how many there were? How many shots there were? I, I counted at least seven when I was there. Did you see more than one shooter? I didn't see the shooter at all. I was on the first floor. From my understanding, the shooter was on the fourth floor. Was he shooting down into the atrium? If he was, I wasn't paying any attention. I heard he was, but I didn't know. I just kept running. What kind of building is that? What kind of building is that? Who works in that building? Um, we have Navy officers, civilians, Marines. It's, our mission is, you know, to take care of the Navy. How secure is it? Uh, being that the incident that happened today, I'm it's not secure enough for me. What sort of how easy should be to get inside? I'm sorry. How easy should it be to get inside? I mean, you need a card, right? You have to have a card to come in. You cannot enter the building before 6:30 without having a card. Once you enter into the building, you need a card to scan to get through to get through the uh, go through the offices. So it's very hard to get in without a car. Was it an emotional experience for you? Yes, very. Describe that. What was, what was going through your head when all this was happening? Well, I just had an incident happen a couple of weeks ago. I lost my sister, so to have this happen, you know, I'm terrified now. I don't even, I don't even know if I want to come back into the building again. I don't feel safe. What do you do to be? What's your position there? I'm a logistics management specialist.